Good morning, you guys. I decided I wanted to vlog today because it's been a while since I've vlogged and just chatted with you guys. I feel like there's a lot going on in my life right now. And yeah, I just thought I should bring you along today. We can chat about some things. I hope you appreciate this fresh 6 a.m. face, 5.30 a.m. I don't know what time it is right now. Probably not 6 a.m. because I need to be in my class at 6 a.m. My workout class. I joined this new workout program and I work out Monday, Tuesday, Thursday mornings at 6 a.m. And it's amazing. I love it. It's called Train Insane. If you're local here in Utah Valley, you should check it out because it is killer. If you want a really hard, hard workout. I've never been pushed so hard. So we've got that going on this morning. Lately, I've been waking up at like 4.30 because I'm freak and I just like to wake up early and take my time before getting to this class but I am feeling pretty tired this morning so I think I'm gonna take either pre-workout or something before class so I'm gonna go do that right now because I need a little bit of a boost before I go downstairs I wanted to show you these leggings they're new I got them on Amazon and they are CRZ yoga leggings so they're the dupes for the align leggings and i don't know you guys they feel really similar but the waist is a little bit lower like i feel like my align leggings come up a little higher and these feel like they might fall a little bit while i work out so that's what we're going to test out today we're going to see we're going to see how these leggings stand up to the test of train insane but i like the color it's really pretty Okay, I was going to do a pre-workout, but I'm gonna try one of these instead. So this company, Proper Wild, sent me some of these products to try, which I thought were really awesome. They are wellness shots, but they have caffeine in them. So I think I'm gonna try one of these. I've tried one of each flavor already. There's this blackberry one, peach mango. They aren't way sweet or way flavored, but I think I'm gonna do this ginger one because I love a kick of ginger. This doesn't have that big of a kick of ginger, but it definitely has a little ginger in it and will give you some energy. So I'm gonna take this instead of a pre-workout. Cheers, guys. Okay, let's hope that gives me the boost that I need. I'm also taking my BCAAs. So these are just really good for recovery and helping you during exercise. So anytime I do a really strenuous workout, I like to take these BCAAs with me. Um, you just do one scoop in, I just do it in this water bottle here and I got this water bottle from Target. But yeah, so I take those especially during a strenuous workout or if I am teaching high fitness because some of you guys may remember I am a high fitness teacher now so I teach an aerobics class pretty high intensity aerobics class twice a week so anyway that has helped me recover from teaching because when you teach you you give like a hundred and ten percent and so when you finish class you're so much more tired than if you were just a participant so this has definitely been a game changer with helping me to recover especially after I teach okay guys I am back from my workout and I just wanted to give you an update on these leggings they're great honestly for 25 bucks they are awesome if you've tried the lululemon align leggings before if you own a pair you might be like these aren't quite as good as those in my opinion I still prefer the align leggings but I don't prefer the price of the Align leg leggings, obviously, because they're a hundred bucks and these are 25, like I said. So I definitely recommend them and I will probably be purchasing more of them. So I will link these specific ones down in the description box because there are two different types of material and this is the matte fleece material and this is the one that's more of a dupe for Lululemon's Align leggings. I've tried the other material and they are too slippery. They're just not like the Align in my opinion. So I will link these ones down below so that you can try these ones and do a comparison for yourself or if you've never tried the Align ones, then you'll be totally stoked with these ones. But I did wanna mention that this bra, if you can see in the back, this is from Crazy Yoga. I call it Crazy Yoga. It's CRZ Yoga. This bra is amazing. I love it, you guys. It is so comfortable, and I just 
didn't expect it to be as good I don't know I just didn't know what I was expecting from it but it's the long line bra and it's very similar to the Lululemon I think it's free to be or I don't know I'll have to look at what it a dupe for because I've actually never had this bra from Lululemon this is the first time trying this particular bra so like I said it is very comfortable very supportive I loved it so this one is a snake skin pattern and I just think it's super cute so I very much enjoyed working out in this outfit today and just thought I would give you the update also wanted to let you know that this proper wild ginger lean energy shot was awesome like I feel so good I don't know if you can tell I have really good energy right now working out always gives me a good amount of energy but that helped me get to my class and push it really hard so I very much enjoy those little shots they're super easy to take um, I think it was like 25 calories yeah 25 calories and I do intermittent fasting and I usually try to avoid any calories while I intermittent fast but occasionally I think it's fine to do like less than 30 calories or so so anyway i will link them down below so that you guys can check them out they did give me an affiliate code so i will put that one down there you guys can use it if you want to use it it supports my channel so i continue making these videos you guys i really appreciate when you do support those links okay ray is awake now so i need to go get her and get her ready for the day because she's actually going with her sitter to the zoo today so that'll be very fun for her i'm kind of sad i can't go with her because i think she's really gonna love seeing all the animals the last time i took her to the zoo she like was too young to really care that much about it i don't know i think she enjoyed it but i know she's going to have a fun time today so i'm kind of sad like i said but that's the life of a full-time working mom i can't be there for all these fun things all the time. And I'm just glad she gets to go have a little adventure while mama works. Okay, bonus with these little bottles. I clean it out, I rinse it out, and then I give it to Ray, or I put a tiny little bit of water in there. <laughs> and she loves drinking from it and taking off the cap and just playing with it. So if you want an extra toy for your kid, these little bottles are perfect. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what I'm packing for the zoo for Ray and the sitter. And our sitter has a daughter that's Ray's age as well. So I always try to pack two of everything in case, you know, we just don't want any fights or stealing each other's snacks. So we just give them the same thing. All right, so I packed some cheddar bunnies and these snack cups. And these snack cups are amazing for toddlers. <laughs> and then, of course, we have some... Oh, uh-oh, someone's coming. She hears the word S-N-A-C-K. Honey, we're gonna eat some breakfast, okay? And sorry for the cocoa melon in the background. She is watching that while I prep her stuff. So we have, like I said, some fruit snacks and some fruit leather, and then just one of these fig bars. Ray loves these. And there's two in a bag, and she usually just eats one. So she can share that one, and then just a nice full thing of water. And I'm going to dress her warm today, but I also packed a blanket as well as a hat and some gloves. It's supposed to be sunny today, but it will be kind of cold. So hopefully they will stay nice and warm. showered guys and washed my hair and I'm just gonna let it air dry today because I don't really have any place to be. Ray is at the zoo right now and I just got sent some pictures maybe I'll toss them up right here but she's having a blast and she's there with her cute little friend and I'm just so happy she got to go do that. So I finally broke my fast because like I mentioned I do intermittent fasting so I'm drinking my protein shake. It's just chocolate protein powder, 
a banana, like half of a frozen banana, and some peanut butter and spinach. So it is very tasty. I will link the protein that I use in the description box below. A lot of people ask me about protein, like protein powders, so I'll have that link down below. But I just got off a call. I'm a meeting for work and it was really good it was like a whole breakdown of how 2020 went and where we're going and it was just really exciting because it just means there's a lot of work ahead of us but it's like clear direction and I love knowing like we have focus and I'm okay with a lot of work if we know what we're doing <laughs> so I'm really excited for this year I think it'll be really good and I've also had another side hustle come up where I am doing some video editing on the side i've been doing that all this past year and i loved it and so i just have another person now that i'm going to be doing some video editing for and yeah it's just good it, it keeps me very busy obviously but that's my personality i like have to be busy all the time it's not always the best thing but i do love feeling like i'm producing things and getting things accomplished but with that i have been a little frustrated the past like couple months feeling like i'm not laying out my days appropriately and i'm just getting lost in all the work and so i actually came across a video from deanna mims who is an awesome creator here on youtube and i've been following her like anti-mlm stuff because you guys if you've watched my anti-mlm video you know i'm pretty much anti-mlm and if you don't know what that means i'll put um like a card up here and you can watch that video but Anyway, she did a video, like a vlog on how to be productive and she had a really great tip on using the notes app in your phone. If you have an iPhone or I'm sure other Android phones or whatever have the notes app. So I'm going to link her video so that you guys can watch that. It's like one of the first tips she mentions at the beginning of the video and she shows you how to do it. And I've been doing that this past week and it really, really is helping me stay focused and feel like I've accomplished things throughout the day because I think what I do on my to-do list is I set too many things like too many big things on there and then I feel so defeated when I only check off like one of the big things and then I do a ton of other little things throughout the day so anywho watch her video you will not regret it and just learn some productive hacks later hey guys I'm still here at my desk I feel like all I do is sit here all day because that's what I do. I just work. I actually went down to Eric's man cave and I sat in his massage chair and worked for like a couple hours and that was really nice. But anyway, I'm just finishing up work for the day. And I wanted to mention over here because I talked about it on my Instagram, but I wanted to... Whoa, Poe. You okay, buddy? He's just like breathing real intense over there. Anyway, I wanted to ask over here as well. If you have done IVF, I would love to know how you paid for it. If you don't mind commenting that down below. I got a ton of responses on Instagram, but it was done through the questions box. So it can be kept pretty anonymous, but I'm just trying to do a lot of research for this video that Eric and I are going to film this weekend. So yeah, if you wouldn't mind, I thought I would ask over here because I might get some more responses that I wasn't expecting. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna finish up work. I'm going to make dinner tonight. Just an easy, like, one pan meal. It's called skillet tamales. I don't know. We'll see. It's a new recipe. But I think I'll show you a quick little tour of my office because I have done some things to it. So let me just flip the camera around. Okay, so here's my desk area, and I love my desk from Ikea, and then I just got this blanket for my mother-in-law. She was giving it away, so I took it, and I love it. I keep it there because I get cold. I got this plant when I was sick in November. Um, my team, they gave me this plant, so I just got this ceramic pot and uh, the stand from Amazon and I'm really loving this plant and apparently a snake plant is really hard to kill So I'm really hoping that's the truth. How you doing, buddy? You feeling okay? Okay, anyway, so this little tassel What do you call this? Macrame? I don't know. This was over on this wall right here But then I put this mirror recently we got this mirror and I put that up there, but I think I'm gonna move it down more and then maybe put like a frame or something and 
I don't know, something over on this side as well. Okay, and I've mentioned this before, but I would like to get a bigger mirror right here where Poe is so that I just have better lighting because this mirror, and it's just kind of small. I want like a big mirror here and a big mirror here. Anyway, so that is what's going on with my office these days. I think I've shown you guys this stuff over here. So yeah, I really like it. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you that meal I made because it was actually pretty good. So I will link it in the description, but here it is. So it's called skillet tamales <laughs> and it doesn't look great, but it's really good, okay? And we actually ate it with some chips as well because just, you know, we wanted to give it a little crunch. So now I'm just gonna clean up the kitchen, my nightly routine while Eric bathes Ray. And then I actually am going to audition to teach high fitness at a community center tonight. So I'm gonna go do that after I clean and I'll have to get ready for that and you know, go over some of my choreography. But if you are still watching this right now, will you please give me the name of an artist that you love to listen to? Because what I do while I clean up every night after dinner is I have Alexa play an artist. Like I just tell her to play an artist for me and she just responded. Anyway, and my rule is I can't say an artist I've said before. So I really start to get hung up on that and like forget names of artists that I like to listen to. So give me a name of an artist that you like to listen to. Someone other than like Taylor Swift or Lady Gaga. People that I already request she play too often. I just got done with my high fitness audition and it was a little bit different than I expected. So what they did was they just had us come to a regular high fitness class and there were three of us there to audition. And the teacher who was like the main teacher teaching that class would just call us up when it was time to teach our particular songs. We each were given two songs beforehand that we needed to teach. So it was different than I expected because I didn't realize we were going to be doing like a full high fitness class. And I already worked out this morning, so I'm a little bit beat. And it's 9.30 and I usually am asleep by now, so... I'm just like, ooh, I'm tired. But it's okay. I am going to just go in, shower, go to bed because tomorrow morning I am doing a makeup class for my train insane because I usually go on Tuesday, Thursdays, but Eric was out of town on Tuesday, so I wasn't able to go that morning. So I'm doing a makeup class tomorrow morning, Friday. So, anywho. <laughs> I need to go to bed but I did want to talk to you guys about the most recent video I put out just right before this and I didn't mean to save this until the end of the video that wasn't my plan I meant to talk about it earlier today but I just wanted to share with you guys when we are planning on doing IVF because I haven't really made that clear I said we are doing IVF and I'm prepping for it right now but the plan is to give ourselves a couple months to try naturally because as I mentioned in my last video we have unexplained infertility or undiagnosed so we don't know why we're not getting pregnant and now that my body has already been through a pregnancy maybe we have a shot of getting pregnant naturally so I talked to my OB and he said that I could get on Clomid if I wanted right now um, just to give ourselves a boost um, and I might do that maybe like next month but we're just gonna yeah give ourselves a couple months and then we will go ahead and schedule an FET frozen embryo transfer because we do have two embryos left and yeah that's the plan we're planning to do IVF but we're also giving my body you know a couple months to just have normal cycles and just not be on any hormone treatments. I'm just taking those supplements that I showed in my last video. And if you wanna see what I'm taking, you can go ahead and, I don't know, click up here somewhere. I will put the video, my last video, I'll put it here somewhere so you guys can watch that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching my video. You guys, I really appreciate all the support. And follow me on Instagram, DM me over there if you wanna chat more. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.